डैश फॉर क्वेरी केस तो भारतीय जनता पार्टी इज टेकिंग ऑन महुआ मोहित्रा अकॉर्डिंग टू बीजेपी महुआ मस्ट क्लैरिफाई टू दी एथिक्स पैनल एंड नॉट टू द मीडिया बीजेपी ऑल्सो वेट एड एंड सेड दैट महुआ हैज कन्फर्म्ड दैट देर हैज बीन अ पार्लियामेंट्री सिक्योरिटी ब्रीच Chori and then Sina Zori is equal to Mahua Moitra. This is the claim that BJP is now making. In fact, it was Mahua Moitra who admitted to have been give, uh, have that she did in fact give her parliament login ID and password to Darshan Hira Nandani. My colleague Shreya is now joining me on the story. Shreya, it seems like the Bharatiya Janata Party, which obviously earlier too was trying to make sure that Mahua Moitra is in the dock after the statement by Mahua Moitra, where she indeed. admitted to the fact that she did give her login credentials to darshan hira nandani it seems like the bjp will not let this issue go well you know ashwari after her uh, mohammed's interview to india today where she suggested that she in fact uh, gave her id and password to someone in darshan hira nandani's office however she said that uh, unless and until you get an otp uh, the answers or the questions are not really put forward she tried to suggest That it was only after the confirmation did it go through. So that was what she had to suggest. However, that sort of uh, has been taken as an acceptance that she had given uh, the uh, the uh, the for the login password details, which uh, Shreya uh, Poonawala has now stated is a clear violation of the NIC document, which says you cannot. Uh, share uh, your login id password what he's gone on to reiterate that uh, now that she's given interview she will also appear before the parliamentary committee remember uh, the earlier date of 31st was rejected by mohammed is why the second summons has been given on the second of november now it is a war that is taking place between mahua moitra on one side and the bhartiya janata party on the other side It was in fact BJP MP Nishikant Dubey who made sure that there was a complaint which was filed against Mahua Moitra. Mahua Moitra in an exclusive interview with India Today she spoke with India Today's Rajdeep Sardesai and did actually admit to the fact that she had given her login credentials to Darshan Hira Nandani. Joining me on the broadcast is BJP spokesperson Shahzad Poonawala. Mr Poonawala Mahua Moitra very clearly did agree to the fact and also admitted that she did give her login ID and password. This is a very, very serious statement coming from Mahua Moitra. You know, her entire attempt so far has been to do chori and sina zori. Instead of presenting herself to the ethics panel, she has all the time to sit in Delhi and give interviews. Why doesn't she go and make all these clarifications before an ethics panel? Nonetheless, she has, in her uh, overzealousness to present her case or to be brazen, has admitted to Rajdeep, and I saw that interview later on. She has admitted to Rajdeep that she has given her parliamentary login. Now, post facto, whatever spin she puts on it that the OTP was with me, oh, I was using secretarial help. Does she think we are fools, Ashwarya? If she was such a big banker like she claimed on Rajdeep's show, she could not have an intern or a PA to file the questions. She has to Darshan. Hiranandani is PA sitting abroad. Same Darshan Hiranandani has a conflict of interest in the same questions that she is asking. 50 out of 60 questions are some questions which are serving his interest, and she gives the secretarial work to the Hiranandani from abroad. And we are fools to believe that it was given for no quid pro quo. And she starts presenting her one-sided case here. Please ask her that uh, first of all, if it would have been a BJP MP, let's assume, and he would have given his parliamentary login to a corporate entity abroad. Would the same TMC not demand his resignation? Today, the shoe is on the other foot. The question is, if you are so, uh, in, in a sense, morally upright, you ask people's resignations at a drop of a hat. Why don't you resign? Present yourself to the ethics panel and let the probe get over. Your own party is not defending the kind of actions you have indulged in. TMC is not willing to open its mouth on this. Clearly, they have sidelined you and distanced themselves. And today the question is not just about parliamentary login security breach. It is about national security breach because we don't know who else has used this login. Secondly, it's a quid pro quo case of corruption, hiring an MP to ask questions, and thirdly, it is a larger conspiracy against economic national interests of India, wherein you collude with forces in order to destabilize India's economic and national interests. So, therefore, there are many angles to this. They must be investigated. Mahua Moitra is only. exhibiting the nervousness and her overzealousness to do chori and then sina zori